Hey, this is Jack Bourne, founder of AW Pro Tools, and this is a case study of someone who asked me, how do I set up my funnels using AW Pro Tools so that I can be promoting multiple different affiliate products? Uh, everyone ends up on the same list, but with each opt-in, when they click the confirmation link in the email, I want them to go to uh, through my affiliate link to a different promotion. So in other words, we've got product A promoted through opt-in form A. So this person is building their list. Um, and they want them to click the confirmation link, but the confirmation link in Aweber uh, is set up so that when you create your list, that's, your, your, that's where you assign, okay, the confirmation link is going to go here. So it can be quite a challenge to be able to have multiple different opt-in forms, but then have a different location based on, uh, you know, sending people to different locations based on uh, the confirmation link. So how do you solve this? Well, <clears throat> luckily there's a, there's a real simple way using AW Pro Tools. So what you can do is you can set it up like so. So let's just look at one landing page and opt-in form. Okay, so actually I need to draw this in here. Let me copy this over. All right, so let's call this the confirmation email. So when they click on the confirmation link, we want them to go th through that to the, um, to the, through the affiliate link. And of course, they're going to go to a, a page where something's being promoted. Okay, so we've got the landing page. They opt in, they click the link. Boom, there they go. Now, if this were just one list, it would be no problem. So uh, what we actually are going to do <clears throat> is that we're going to set up multiple different lists. So in this case, the person said that they're promoting 10 different products as an affiliate, but everyone needs to end up on this main list, even though when they click the confirmation link, they're going in 10 to 10 different landing pages. So we've got, number one, we've got our main list that everyone is going to end up on. Next, we've got one list per product that you're going to set up. And for each list, you're going to have an opt-in form. So this opt-in form works with, works with this list. Okay, now the other key thing to note, as you've seen that I've written here, is that this list and all of the other 10 feeder lists are going to have no follow-up messages. None. And this will become uh, clear why we're going to do that in just a second. So here's what's going to happen. Someone's going to come to the landing page, they're going to choose to opt in. They're going to arrive at a page that says click the link in your email. So they go to their email, they click the confirmation link, and they're going to, uh, they're going to go to the, go through the special affiliate link that is determined in that list. You with me so far? So pretty, pretty simple stuff, but they're not currently on this list right here. They're not on this list yet. So how do we get them on this list? Well, inside of AW Pro Tools, there's something called an automation robot. And it's really cool because what it does is it waits to see when someone, it, it looks inside of whatever list you tell it to, or multiple lists, and you can tell it to look for people who have reached the last follow-up for that list. And then when they've reached the last follow-up, however many people that is, you can choose to move them to another list. Now, you can also do some other cool things, such as wait a certain number of days, um, or move them to email. You can, you can start them, say, on email number two or email number three. You can choose what email you want to you add them to. So a lot of cool different features, but the main core function is that when someone reaches the end of the follow-ups for a certain list, you can then move them to a new list. So you don't need to have any follow-ups in your list in order for this to work. So since there are no follow-ups, as soon as someone arrives on that list, well, guess what? They're going to be considered at the end of that list. So every single day, everyone who is added to this list is going to be automatically shuffled over to the main list. Now, let's take a look real quick at what would, how this would look if you had multiple different products. Let me, uh, let me try to zoom out here for a second. And let's look at layer two and layer three. And I'll slide this over like so. Okay, so same thing. We have a landing page opt-in. Go click the email. Let me slide this over. Go click the email. And I actually need to change this to list C. 
Okay, so now that I have that set up, um, what we want to do is, so I'll, I'll just walk you through this. In the same way, list B also has no follow-ups, but the confirmation link is determined by how you set up list B, and so that would be your affiliate link. So as soon as they click that confirmation link, boom, they go through your affiliate link to the offer. But then because there are no follow-ups, the AW Pro Tools automation robot will move them to the main list. And again, you can start them wherever you want. You want to start them here? No problem. You want to start them here? No problem. In fact, if you want to wait three days, as an example, you can wait three days. So same thing over here. Just to finish this out, you get a landing page opt-in. The confirmation link, which is going to be this affiliate link, is determined in list C right here. The list C has no follow-up. So when someone clicks that, they're now confirmed on that list, but because they're considered at the end of list C, the AW Pro Tools automation robot will automatically add them over to the main list. And so everyone gets filtered over onto the main list by the AW Pro Tools automation robot. So that's a way for you to very quickly set up your 10 feeder lists that really have no follow-up messages and the only purpose is just to to basically queue people up like an assembly line for the AW Pro Tools automation robots to then move those people efficiently every single day over to your main list. So I hope that helps and go if, if you're interested, if you use Aweber, there's a lot of other cool things that you can do with AW Pro Tools, add in a lot of trigger-based, behavior-based automation into your follow-up marketing. It's extremely powerful. So go check it out. Try it, try it on me, try it on me for 14 days. Go sign up at awprotools.com. Look forward to having you as a client.